Hey guys, it's Eric here at LearnMax. Uh, I was going to take the evening off tonight, but it turns out that the ladies in the household are watching Glee, so I figured I'd rather spend my time with you guys. And anyway, we're going to add FM to our uh, synth project here. Uh, we're also going to add simple sine waves as oscillator types. So let's take a look at a couple of different things. Uh, first off, let's uh, move some stuff around here to make a little bit of room. This is our uh, main screen here. I'm going to move these guys over here. And I have my square wave and my triangle wave, uh, my, my choices over here. Let's take a look at those. Uh, and in here, you'll see I've already added uh, a type. Uh, so I have none, triangle, square, sawtooth, and sine now. I'm going to add that to both of those guys. Uh, I still have the balance. Now I'm going to go into P -osk mess, And in there, I'm going to add, first I'm going to enable it for editing. And I'm going to add two new parameters, and I'm going to copy this, 4 and 5, those are going to be my new types here, they're going to be floating point numbers, okay. And they're going to be, I'm going to need two dials, a uh, live dial here. And that's going to be my first one. The first one is going to be my, um, my uh, the ratio between my carrier frequency and my modulator frequency. Uh, so that's the first one here. And the second one is going to be the modulation index, or how much modulation is going on. And let's see, let's uh, look at the parameters here. These are going to, let's see, vary between 0 and 127 inner floats. Now let's try that out for starters. Okay, so let's see what's changed so far. Nothing yet. So we have two new types. We're going to go in here now. Let's see, open up our original voice. And we're going to zoom in a bit here. Oh, we're going to unlock it. Zoom in, and you'll see I've already done a little bit here. I, I, I cheated. I got ahead myself. Um, setting up FM, it's a little bit tricky. So like I was saying, um, I've already done a, a couple of things, and there's the, the two new parameters, the harmonic index, which is the ratio of the modulator frequency to the carrier frequency, and then there's the modulation index, which is the amount of modulation so it's kind of the depth of the modulation so you see what fm really does is it's frequency modulation you're modulating the frequency of one oscillator with another oscillator so basically what that means is you're going to be doing a combination of uh, multiplication and addition so you're changing dynamically changing the frequency of your oscillator at audio rates basically instead of going you, you basically start with like a tremolo or a siren type of effect but you you increase the frequency so high that it starts to create overtones and things in, in the sound. So you'll see here that harmonic index, I'm multiplying the original uh, the original frequency, my M2F, you remember that down here, SIG comes through, multiplies the original frequency, determines that becomes the, uh, the frequency of my modulator here, right? So this is my modulator, this is my carrier down here. So my original frequency just goes straight through and goes to my carrier, but it has this other bit added to it. It you know it modulates it up and down, and that's what's going on here. It sets that uh, frequency, sets that up, and then it multiplies the depth uh, in here, and then uh, yeah multiplies things through, adds it in, and that gives me my frequency. Now what I'm also going to do. Is I got to add that sign uh, that sign thing in here. So let's see. Uh, da -da -da. Open that guy up and uh, unlock him. Zoom in so you can see this. And I already recorded this video once and I screwed up and didn't uh, add this in. So that's why I got to do it again. So cycle. There's my sign oscillator. And I grab that, my frequency coming in, and I got to make sure to add a 4 there so that my selector, which is getting passed in that uh, um, that choice from the menu, that, that gets uh, called in there. All right, so that should be it. 
I have my new frequency type, uh, excuse me, I have my new oscillator type, which gets copied already over here, right? That's the, the cool thing about subpat. Oh, no, oh, it didn't. Um, oh, that's right, this is just a subpatch or not. Okay, I'm gonna add that one here quick too. Ah, all right. Why did I think that was gonna get copied there? Cycle and I guess that's one of the tricky things about uh, sub patchers. Uh, if they're the embedded ones, you can actually have two that are the same name. Uh, if they're saved out to a file, then they're they're not going to have they're going to be the same name and they're going to be the same thing. Hmm. All right, all right. So I've changed both of those now. Um, by not hearing any difference because uh, when you make big changes like that, you're going to have to save that out. That this actually is its own patch. And now I don't hear anything. And let's see, I'm going to add these two things to the presentation. Add to presentation, whoops, add to presentation, and go into presentation mode real quick. And I'm going to copy that one here, and this one there. Call one uh, ratio. And call the other depth. Just so it should seem clear. Hopefully, when we save it, it'll, you'll be able to hear that. And click on that, save it, and we'll hope for the best. All right. Well, let's set these to sine wave. Simple sine wave there. Now let's start meshing with ratio and depth. Am I getting it? Where did I go wrong? Let's see. 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 Hmm, I think I found it. Let me just start recording again. I think that was it. Can you believe that? I left that space out. Let's lock that. And we're going to need probably to save everything. Sure enough. Can you believe that? All right. Well, there we have it. FM. <laughs> All right. Uh, enjoy. Happy patching. Thanks for joining me and saving me from watching Glee. All right. Uh, take care. Uh, this is Eric at LearnMax. Remember, subscribe and check back in often. Cheers.